Welcome to Cryptopia Cast. I am your co-host Laudi, and today we will be interviewing Aaliyah Ashley. Aaliyah Ashley is one of the moderators for Cryptopia, and she's going to be talking about how she got started into crypto and what it takes to step out of your comfort zone. So stick around and enjoy the show. Welcome back. Like I said before, we are interviewing Aaliyah, who is one of the moderators of Cryptopia. Aaliyah, welcome to the show. Hi guys, hi Cryptopia, hi Kiraudi. Uh, I'm so happy to be, he- uh, to be here and I hope you enjoy this as much I enjoy it. So <laughs> yeah, let's go. <laughs> let's go, all right. Always with the bubbly personality. Aaliyah, can you go ahead and tell everyone right now who is Aaliyah Ashley? So, um, hi guys, my name is Ali Ashley and I am 19 years old. I am currently studying a Bachelor of Science, Business Administration, major in Marketing Management. Oh. So, yeah, I'm into marketing, guys. <laughs> and um, I chose this um, path like because I know that I will excel on this and i really believe in myself so i love my course so yeah let's do it so <laughs> uh, i did it and i'm so happy uh, um as far as i'm taking it i'm, I'm so happy with my course oh so, yeah Definitely. yeah I'll, I'll, i can really see that you have a lot of confidence in you and i think that speaks volumes into your personality now, oh, thank you. You're welcome. Yeah, definitely. So <laughs> let me just go ahead and ask. Uh, well, your Discord username is Abo. What's up with that? Yeah. That's kind of weird. Yeah. So if you guys are wondering, I'm one of the moderators here in Cryptopia. I am a peculiar, as they call it. And yeah, my name in Discord is Abo. Um, because <laughs> you guys are wondering, Alia Ashley, why Abo? It's it's so yes, like, you have so no, many it's names. Not, it's not connected at all. So, yeah. Um, at first, when I wanted to join Discord, I was not really into like uh, big communities. It's just a personal account actually, and then um. I said to myself that I wanted my name here in Discord to be different from my name, but also connected. So what I did was um, Ali, or uh, what my friend call, calls me is Ali. So Ali is like common. So I said, no, I will not put that in my Discord. And then right. um, Ashley is also common. And then what I did was I'll just use my second name and I cut it in half like Ashley. And when you, uh, Lee is like too short and it's not me at all. So what I did was I cut it in half. I chose Ash. And when you translate Ash into Tagalog, is Abo. So, so okay. my name in Discord is Abo. It's different, but it's, it's still me, right? Like yeah. I just translated <laughs> my, my name in uh, Tagalog. So that's what I did. And look, guys, I'm the only one whose name is Abo in Discord. I don't, it's, it's unique. <laughs> so <laughs> yeah, that's why I chose it. So definitely. <laughs> so yeah, that, that explains it then. So Ash, you know, if you translate that into Filipino, it's going to be Abo. So yeah, yeah. <laughs> thank you very much unique, for giving right? us a <laughs> very unique. Yes, indeed. Thank you very much for giving us a, a, a quick explanation of why your name is Abo. So I'm sure everyone in Discord right now are very interested in knowing what does Abo do on her free time when she's not talking up discussions in our Discord community? Well, <laughs> I talk a lot. So <laughs> if I don't do uh if I don't do Discord, you will see me talking to myself. No kidding. Um <laughs> I'm talking to a lot of people. Actually, I um in my free time, um I do chores. I love cleaning, to be honest. Whoa. I really do, yeah. Wow. It's a thing. I, it's therapeutic for me. Oh true. Um, yeah, yeah, I clean the house. Um, I don't like cooking. I don't know how to cook. <laughs> all right, so all right. um, I just do cleaning. Uh, I think I um, I'm good at that. And then, um, actually, I'm I'm just in Discord. You will see me in Discord like most of the time, twenty four seven. Actually, you will see me <laughs> in a voice channel talking to a lot of people and just um, because I I really love I really do love talking. It's um it's also therapeutic for me and it boosts my confidence. To be wow. honest, yeah, it does and. Um, I'm really happy, like, um, 
making connections with people and you know to know them and to uh, to know me uh, because if you're talking to somebody you kind of like a review it to yourself and you're you're like yeah i'm this i'm her <laughs> like that <laughs> you know and, okay and uh, yeah so i find it um therapeutic so that's what i do i also do um cleansing i cleanse my aura i do meditating oh. yeah um those are my interests to be honest i i use stones um yeah i talked to john about it because john also has stones um mm-hmm. and um yeah i'm encouraging some of my friends to try uh, meditating because because it really helps you um uh it brings peace to yourself so yeah i highly recommend that guys try meditating and do research about that so yeah that, that is uh very interesting indeed i'm i'm, I'm actually surprised that <laughs> that's something that you do and um you know going back to what you said that you like talking and i'm sure everyone has already seen you or heard you do some hostings for cryptopia yeah. um there, is there some way in the future that you know, you're gonna become a host for Cryptopia. Is that is that something that you aspire to? Why not? If um the opportunity is given, like why not? I, uh, like as I said earlier, I really love talking, and it comes naturally. To be honest, I I try to stop it, <laughs> <laughs> and um, I just tried to be quiet at first um mm-hmm. here in this sport channel. But as time goes by, my mouth <laughs> it kind of stops. <laughs> so I just talk and talk and talk, and there was like. No, you need to host. Go host a game night. And I was like, no, I will not do that. I just talk to you guys because I like you. Because I like talking to people. But I don't want to do hosting. But they're like, no, you can do it. We believe in you. Yes. You're so funny. <laughs> I was like, no, I'm not funny. No, you should try. And then I did. And look, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I'm it, talking now. <laughs> it, was a, it was a very fun night. And uh, we really do thank you for you know giving that a shot. Uh, and as oh, it turned out, you. you know, it was a, a very successful night. Everyone enjoyed you hosting the event. So thank you very much, Aliyah, for doing that. No, thank you, guys. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, okay. Let's go ahead and talk about Cryptopia right now. How did you, you know, how did you get started with Cryptopia? How did you find us out? Oh, okay. So I found out about Cryptopia because we have this game night in my... um sub guild uh mm-hmm. it's a home guild where i came from um uh it's a bingo night actually and after the bingo night um the host is like um azuriel is going to give out prizes if you raid cryptopia and mm-hmm. i was like oh prizes i like that so <laughs> what i did was i joined mm-hmm. and then i raided cryptopia i said hi mm-hmm. i'm from sandogang and then um I was like ready to leave Cryptopia, to be honest, because oh, wow. um my yeah my goal is like to stay in Axi, to be honest, mm. um because I, I'm not into crypto at all at first, and I was like no I will just stay here I just want to learn um how to play Axi and to somehow yeah. earn and I will stay here. There's no other games that I know that is actually legit. Yeah, that's my uh, thought. No games are le- uh, are legit other than Axie. That's my first thought. Then I was like, uh, I don't like uh, other servers hanging around on my Discord um, account. Yeah, yeah. So I'm ready to leave Cryptopia. But I saw the Getting Started uh, mm, channel. Wow. Yeah. Okay. yeah, I did. Yeah. And I was like, Factions? What's this? This is my first time hearing Factions, um, actually. And I was like, why do you have to pick um factions and i was like oh it's like a character i i like it and i was like but i don't know a thing i'm too scared to ask in general (laughs) chat because i'm overwhelmed um and i was like i remember (laughs) what uh the host said who um who will do some prizes like who will give out prizes and it's azuriel so what i did was i dm'd him and i asked him like um what is cryptopia um why do you why do I need to pick factions and what are the differences yeah. between those factions? And um you know what? He is so great at that. He provided like uh, visuals um and also like text uh saying that what uh what is traditional, what is eco, what is tech, what is um industrial and it really helped me and I was like, 
Oh, this is actually interesting. I like it, and I ask him if the game is um already out, and he said no, na it's uh it's still in development. So I said, oh, okay. So I, I will stay here. That's why that's my thought. So I I thank him, and my goal is like to stay here and to stay in Axi. Um, so yeah, I discovered Cryptopia through uh, Azriel because of the raid, and I learned how to love Cryptopia because wow. of my other friends. Also, um, Kuya uh, Kuya Dubi, uh, yeah. uh, Reyes, um, was actually um the guest here last time. Uh, he is uh, also one of the factors why I love Cryptopia because he said that um, this is a great game. You guys should uh, visit us often here in Cryptopia, and that's what I did. I um, I always say hi to them. I tried yeah. to talk. Um, um, I tried to talk uh, about Cryptopia with them, and and I'm so uh, really grateful how and I'm so happy how um, they're so approachable. They really are, and and because of that, here I am. I love Cryptopia. I'm in Cryptopia. I am one of the moderators of Cryptopia, so I I'm so <laughs> so happy, and I'm so grateful to them. Really, like, um, so yeah. Well, I really love that story because you know you transitioned from someone who doesn't want to be a part of Cryptopia to being a part of Cryptopia. Can you share what's the mentality like for someone who is stepping out of their comfort zone and uh, realizing that this is the place they really want to be, right? Can you go ahead and share us the mentality of how that works? Well, it's hard to be honest because um, you get scared when you're trying to go out of that comfort zone. It's really scary. Like, um, there's expectations, um, and what if I don't meet them, right? So, yeah. Um, those things comes to my mind, but um, my personality is like fighting and said, "No, you can do it if you can talk to a lot of people in, in your personal life. What more in this court? And you should try it." And uh, that's what I did. I tried, and um, I, you know, just do it. That's the thing uh, that keeps on um, repeating on my mind. Just, just do it. Just try. There's no, um, there's no harm on trying so that's what i did and i really enjoy it to be honest if i didn't do that what will happen to me <laughs> like um cryptopia and the web tree itself web tree itself um gave me a lot of confidence and you know opportunities in a way that i um i discovered i can do things um like hosting hosting game nights talking to a lot of people entertaining them at some point and and it's really a great thing to be honest i never knew that i can do it and yeah so that's what i did <laughs> yes and i'm really proud of you for doing that you know it really takes a lot of confidence um a lot of guts to go ahead and do something that you're not comfortable and look look where you are now you know you're one of the most successful moderators for cryptopia and uh, speaking oh, of being you. uh, <laughs> you're welcome you're welcome and Speaking of being a moderator for Cryptopia, um, can you go out and share what it's like to be a moderator for Cryptopia? Um, as I said earlier, it is so fun. To be honest, it's so fun for me. It's so fun. Um, my uh, co-moderators can vouch me on that. How happy I am to be a moderator <laughs> here because I always talk to them. Like even yeah. though um, it's not my um. Oh, time to be in the Discord, and I was like, "No, I still talk to you guys. <laughs> you know, I love talking. I love talking about Cryptopia too. So if you have some topics, let's talk about that. If I'm free, let's talk about it. And um, and I'm also grateful because of uh, some of my friends are actually visiting Cryptopia, and they're oh uh, they're curious about Cryptopia because of me. <laughs> I would like to say that it's because of me. Uh, they visit me, and when they visit me, uh. We talk about um, personal things, but also we talk about uh, Cryptopia. So um, they come back not because um, not because of me, now, but it's because of um, the curiosity that they have for Cryptopia. Wow. So yeah, so yeah, I'm really happy that uh, my friends are so supportive, and um, they actually visit me every day, every night. So yeah, I'm <laughs> That's so great. thankful. Yeah, definitely, and. Uh... I do see the conversations that you have every night with, you know, friends 
with different people from around the world and um, you're always very inviting everyone loves to talk to you and that's why they hang out in our discord so speaking of you know hanging out in discord how important is it for a project to have a thriving community a community that likes to talk to each other? how is how important is that i think it really is important because um you know they wanted someone to talk to when it comes to a project because um, just seeing a project for me, example, I just seen Cryptopia, and what did I do? I almost um, got out of Cryptopia, right? But yeah. um, <clears throat> but if you have a thriving community, um, um, always uh, there's always a people that wants to talk to you. I think you will uh, gain a lot of connections, and actually, um, it builds interest um to the project itself so i think it really is important and um that's what i am doing here in cryptopia it's actually what i was um you know envisioning um things to happen in cryptopia to build a more a stronger community for us you know and um i think it's working i really think it is and um i'm just happy to um to be with them and you know it's not only about me or like about cryptopia it's about the people that um uh, that trust the project and it's really um uh, my heart is so happy whenever i hear like they they really uh i really love cryptopia because um they say things like for example i really love cryptopia because of the factions i i love how uh, wow. we have factions here and i was like really and it, it makes me happy because um you know, um, I guided them and then they actually learned from me and it's a happy thing. It's not only for me, but also for them and for the community. So I think it really is important. And uh, to be honest, I love doing it for Cryptopia. Uh-huh. So, yeah. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, definitely, um, you know, a thriving community really does help your project and uh, it's very fulfilling for the people that are supporting the game, that are, you know, working hard like yourself to promote the game so thank you very much for that um one last question for everyone i am sure that after this podcast a lot of young women will be looking up to you you being a student but you're already working and crypto where everybody can say is the place to be what is your advice for young women who want to get into crypto that are you know studying right now working at the same time what advice can you give well the advice i can give them is um just uh, really do it if you're thinking of going into crypto i want you guys to do it because um if you're thinking of it already uh it means that in your heart there's interest in really doing it so why not uh, pursue it I know it's scary. I know it's hard because sometimes our thoughts are like, I don't know anyone here. I don't know how it works. Um, what will happen to me? And, you know, guys, um, that's my mentality too at first. I don't know everyone. Uh, I don't know anyone in our Discord server. But um, as time goes by, someone will talk to you eventually. Uh, actually, if you approach first, um, a lot of people will try to talk to you because everyone here is uh, approachable especially in cryptopia you just say hi everyone will say hi to you everyone will be interested um, in knowing you and you can ask them uh, questions about crypto uh, how does play to earn uh, free to play uh, works and um so i want you guys to do it and just enjoy it while while doing it do some research on your own of course but if you uh if you really want to build connection at first and to really venture it after that that's a great um idea. I I'm encouraging you to um to guys really do it. If if you are thinking about it, do it, guys. Because look at me, I'm into crypto already, and I'm really happy. This really fulfills my heart, and I'm so happy to be here and sharing this with you guys. So so yeah. Ah, uh, thank you very much. I'm sure a lot of our listeners right now will be very happy that for me. I'm sure that they'll be taking that to heart pursuing crypto or pursuing any other dream you know, the word the key phrase there is just do it really yeah it is 
So again, uh, thank you very much, Aliyah, for joining us for this podcast. I'm, I've really learned a lot from you, and uh, I'm really happy to that I was able to know you more, you know, tonight. And uh, I'm sure everyone in our Discord community is gonna be very happy. They watch this episode. They're gonna be talking you up all night after this. Um, do you have um, any messages for them you know, for our Discord community? Um, do you have any? special someone that you wanted to say hello to? Well, um, uh, I would like to thank you guys for having me here. As I said earlier, I hope you enjoyed this as much as I enjoy it. Because I really do. I really enjoy talking, guys. So look at me. <laughs> I'm still here. I'm still, you know, enthusiastic. And um, to my friends out there, thank you very, uh, thank you guys so much for hanging out with me in Cryptopia. Um, you know who you are. And I'm so thankful and I'm so grateful to have you there. And yeah, see you in Discord. So thank you. <laughs> thank you. All thank right. You all right. Thank you very much. And with that being said, Thank you, everyone, for listening in. It has been a great night. See you on the next episode of Cryptopia Cast. Bye, guys.